This is a NLRP3 inflammasome. NLRP3 inflammasome is made up of three component proteins. They are NLRP3, ASC and caspase 1. The NLRP3 protein has three domains. They are LRR, NBD and PYD. The ASC protein has two domains. They are PYD and CARD. The caspase 1 also has two domains. They are CARD and caspase. During assembly of NLRP3 inflammasome, the proteins like NLRP3, ASC and caspase 1 aggregate. Also during assembly of the NLRP3 inflammasome, homotypic domains of NLRP3, ASC, caspase 1 interact with each other. Means during assembly of the NLRP3 inflammasome, the PYD domain of NLRP3 protein interacts with the PYD domain of ASC protein and CARD domain of ASC protein interacts with the CARD domain of caspase 1. There are many activators of inflammasome. The activators of inflammasome are divided into two categories. They are sterile activators and pathogen associated activators. Sterile activators are of two types. They are self-derived and environment derived. The self-derived activators include ATP, cholesterol crystals, urate crystals, glucose, amyloid beta, hyaluronan. The environment derived activators include alum, asbestos, silica, alloy particles, UV radiation, skin irritants. The pathogen associated activators are of four types. They are bacteria derived, virus derived, fungus derived and protozoa derived. The bacteria derived activators include pore forming toxins from S. aureus and Clostridia, flagellin, peptidoglycan fragment, RNA, DNA. The virus derived activators include RNA, influenza M2 protein. The fungus derived activators include beta glucans, manan, gymosan, hyphae. The protozoa derived activators include hemojoin. Now some important points. The term inflammasome was coined by Joff and his colleagues. IL-1 alpha and IL-1 beta are encoded by different genes. Please like, subscribe and share.